Alright everyone, into the holy pillar we go. How many times now have we seen this light? Why do you need to ask that question? We've discussed this. Where are Dats and Zats? I have them take refuge in the hold. Okay everyone, don't forget to watch over me. This is going to work this time. You'll see. Yes. Of course. Oh, wondrous and beautiful first flight! My brooch awaits your divine radiance! Let's keep watch. What? We should watch over Airy. Right. Chapter 8, A World of Echoes, Circle. Ning. Good morning. Time to wake up. Come now, that, that's it. <gasps> the inn, again. And the great chasm? The taint has yet to lift from the sea, if the view from here is any indication. So we've been to, um, let's see, five worlds now, correct? Just what is happening to us, Aerie? Sorry, but I can't really explain it either. <sighs> well, no point in trying to think through the unthinkable. We'll just have to go awaken the crystals here in this world, too. Yes. Yes, of course. Ahoy! Yes, because doing the same thing over and over again, that's got to be the right way to go. It. Are we dreaming? I wonder if we aren't all in a dream right now. I mean, the Great Chasm is still open, and the sea is back to the way it was before. How else would you explain it if it weren't a dream? But you don't normally know when you're dreaming while you're in the middle of a dream, right? At least when I dream, I don't realize it until I wake up. Do you mean like a dreamlike state? Like a trance or something as such? Or do you mean an actual dream? Idea, would you mind kissing me on the cheek? Why? Don't you think you can have your way just because this is a dream? No, don't take it the wrong way. I just, I want to check whether this is really a dream or not. Now, I'll just close my eyes while you pucker up and plant one right here. Ouch! The pinch test is how you check for whether you're dreaming or not. Alright, alright, this isn't a dream. Long live the Glutton Queen. Ah, uh, Caldicillian Seafood Cuisine is positively divine. Each one is a festival of freshness, so juicy and full of flavor. Oh, my mouth can't, won't stop watering just thinking about it. It must be so nice to live in a port town. Idiot, your appetite is beyond impressive. It's downright scary. Grilled Caldicillian Mackerel, Buccaneer Marlin Saute, Tricolored Crab steamed right in its shell. Stewed buckler flounder, sweet salmon sashimi, roast king tuna. Not only that, but she said the gold cod stew I ordered looked delicious, then ended up eating over half of it. She even ate the fried broad cut cutlass fish I was unable to finish. How could you possibly eat that much and live? How does your stomach feel right now? Just a bit uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm more worried about how far my belly is sticking out. Well, you're a growing girl. You'll work it off as long as you stay active. Ah! What? What? I forgot about the grilled squid! I bet it's positively divine. Come on, let's go. Hurry! I, I think she really means it. <laughs> Aerie is so cute. Alright. Okay, so we're gonna change Tiz's job. You're gonna be... All 
Alright, what did I write down for this? Speed 20% up. I want that, yes. I don't know why you'd want... Why the person I was checking with, talking about, wanted me to have this. But whatever, we'll throw it on there. My resident Dark Knight. S slash. Time mag. Oh, sword magic. Either. Oops, no. I don't want to get rid of all these. Alright, for you, we definitely want to throw on uh, two handed. I know that for a fact. Throw on Gloom, I'm guaranteeing we do, because this boosts damage dealt by dark attacks. And then, I think, to make sure this works out, we want to throw up Okay. And you, I don't think want, we want you to be that. I think we need you to be a thief. Yep, Michelin is what I want. And we also would like you to have... Hasten World. And Anya's, we are going to make you a Spirit Master. Slash white mage. Okay, you're already good there. Oh shit, no, that is what I want. Uh, kinda. I want holy one. Missing one of the abilities that I should uh, that I need. Give me a sec here. Well, the guy I was talking to suggested this, and okay, no, I might, I should have it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. So now we'll go to equip. And since... So you get 274 with that, and 286 with that. Okay, so that's all I'll use. You got the Brave Suit. Equip you. Two Falcon Knives. Oh no, get out of here. Ring. 
Who'd want a reflect ring on? I don't think I'm ever going to attack with you, so I'll just throw that on. And... Very soon. Let's get our Hermes sandals on. Alright, so speed. You should be 88, 165, 87. How do we get you to be a little faster? That'll do it. Ideally, you guys should all be faster than her. Than Anya's. The plan falls apart if you guys are not faster than her. Which we will find out in just a moment when we go to do our first fight. Continue. Okay. Off we go. So I remember being really annoyed, frustrated, and pissed off at one of the fights in this chapter, uh, particularly. So with any luck, I won't have the same problem with this setup that I've been trying to work out. Brace for the Vestal's attack. Defend the hold and avoid bloodshed wherever possible. Upon capture. She's to be treated with utmost respect and care. Hmm. Those were really the Grand Marshal's words? They were. Based upon the unanimous decision of the Council, no less. Ah! Uh, where's the sport in that? Can't be helped, Beris. I'm with the Big Ox. That sounds dreadfully dull. I'm sure our little firebug agrees. Watch your tongue! What? I'll have the respect I'm going to do as your elder. What did you just say? Uh, yes. How boring. Terribly boring. Awful, really. Enough. This is an order from the Lord Marshal. The Vestal's to be given the royal treatment in our own fashion, of course. Now, just a... I clearly told you. You did. We have our orders, and your role as messenger is done. Not your fault if we take a bit of creative license in following them. Now is it? Unless you'd care to join us, I'm certain that we can make room for one more. Yes! Yes! Stay and punch things with us, Alternus! Punch them darkly! I don't... Look, I have other orders to relay. That is my job. I ask that you do yours. Stop your worrying, Didim. The Vestal and Adia will be received in grand fashion as ordered. Now you said it yourself. You've important work to do. Go on. on. Shoo. <laughs> okay. So. This, uh... Could be bad. Could be awesome. We'll see how it goes. <sighs> this is gonna be rough. I just remember the fights in this chapter being particularly difficult.
Okay. Hail, Wind Vestal and Company. I, Knight Argent Heichel, and my Sky Knights challenge you to battle. Heinkel, if you'd only listen a... Idea. He's right, Idea. One look at his eyes tells you diplomacy will get us nowhere. Ah, seems the great Vestal's as wise as they say. Jeez, why is everyone so bloodthirsty? What a pain. Uh, that's what I'm saying! <laughs> All right, let's begin! Okay, let's see if this works for me. Behold the joined might of the knights of the Eternian Sky. Okay, so I got a brave choice here, and we're going to use my hero. Brave three times, we're gonna cast Drain. Uh, who do I want to take out first? I guess Heinkel. Alright, this could get me killed, so we'll see. Convert BP. Okay, all's, all's, all's well so far. About 40,000 left each, it looks like. 50,000 for Barris.
Yep, team battle time. Okay. So if this goes well... Oh, the Chapter 8 ones are really difficult. Great white mage. Your ambitions will be dashed upon my rocky ass. Okay. Huh. Off come the kid blood. All right, so it seems to work. Ish. Well, that's right, I can't do any damage. Oops. Okay, so. Oops. My hero. Duck. Oh, do we still have drain on? We do. So. See you later. Uh, the mighty Barris defeated by these children? <laughs> Better to 
go out in a blaze and slowly fade away. That's right, Anya's would have none of that, exactly. Seems the battle is ours. By a hair, I, I can hardly move. What? No we got that kidding. unscathed. I'm absolutely ragged. <laughs> Come now. The Sword Master's training sessions are worse than this. Fighting one-on-one -on -one and fighting with a group are completely different animals. Captain! Our transports arrived! They've sent us a shiny new airship! Ominous is already on board, and Holly is asking if she can bring her bed with her! Well, they fox, so... Well, Lady Bestel? Adia, I'll confess I have no idea what it is you're trying to accomplish, but the Grand Marshal seems to have some inkling. It's time we return to the Duchy. May we meet again sometime, somewhere. I'll be ready to give you another working over then. Yes, sir. Until then. Okay, so that was the first of the groups of bosses we're going to fight here. Alright. And there's still lots of time left on the stream, so... Let's go to the next one. I'm glad that worked. Uh... So yeah. What? Is it called for you too, Jacken? Is that a problem? Personally, I'm more shocked to see you here. It's a wonder you get invited anywhere with that attitude. Arrogant toad. Feeble insults aside, I agree. There is no call for me to be bothered with all this. And who decorates their house like this? All this clatter's fit to make my eyes bleed. You have never seen the royal palace before? Seems we're all here. Your, Your Majesty. This boy is Jackal, bearer of the thief's asterisk. A thief? Well, so be it. Oi, who's the walking timepiece here, and why'd you call him your majesty? Hold your tongue. Ah, Erutus. How long has it been since last we met? You never seek my presence of late, though I had sought to be so very accommodating. Oh, I ask that you forgive your humble servant, Majesty. I fear work has been running this way and that. All for is His Majesty and Ansham, of course. Hmm, I'm so very well. Kent just received word from Central Command in Eternia. It seems they've decided to meet the Vestal in a final showdown within the Duchy proper. Oh? And what of Ansham? Are we to pick up and leave? What of the wealth? The factories? The influence I have here? Am I to abandon it all? No! I will not stand for this lunacy! Hmm. A valid claim, to be certain. However, I sympathize with the Duchy's anti crystallist beliefs and have devoted my rule to them. Now, the Duchy, the shining light of reason that delivered us from theocracy, cries out for help. I must heed this call, even if it means ceding my throne to another. 
You are free to your own opinion. I am not sharing one ounce of such sentiments. Isn't that right, Jacker? Come now, speak up! Hey, any street's the same to a thief. What about you, Chief? I will defer to His Majesty's command. Bah! This is insane! Absolute madness! I will not obey such a foolish order! Now, if you will excuse me, I bid you a refreshing day. So be it. Kent, read my decree so that all may hear. As you wish. By royal decree of His Majesty, Eloc Quintus Kemmer VIII, all domestic assets of Erutus Profiture, chairman of Kammer and Profiture Merchantry, are hereby frozen from this day hence. F frozen? No. 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 No! With everything frozen, I'll be... What will I do? You will cooperate. Else I'll have this draft enacted as an official fiat. Your choice. Fight by my side, Erutus. Let us save the duchy together. Do so, and you shall be rewarded with all my assets. An amount easily double what you have now. Oh, oh, oh. First the stick, now the carrot. Your majesty is most persuasive. And chime super spicy cuisine. Oh, that was positively divine! It's good to know that and chime super spicy cuisine is going strong here in this world, too. It sure is. I mean, I'm covered in sweat. I feel like I've been in a sauna. I can't believe you both could handle extra spicy. I wouldn't dare to try. Nor I, but I have figured out one thing of late. Ice cream is simply wonderful after a spicy meal. You know, you're right. But even without that, I feel as if I cool I, I, I cool down just a bit after a spicy meal. Oh, it's more than a feeling. The sweat evaporates, it actually does cool the body. That makes it perfect for Enchan, the land blessed by constant zephyr from the Temple of Wind. So that must be why the spicy cuisine took root here in this hot desert island. Exactly. Now, on to the next place. Alright, bring it on. What? Spicy restaurant hopping? I don't know if I can handle this. Yeah, your assholes are gonna hate you the next day. Or even the next couple hours, depending on uh, how quick your digestive system works. Okay. We're gonna reset our recording.